These days, most of the people coming to your website are going to be on mobile devices. Whether it's a mobile phone or a tablet device, mobile devices are extremely popular. So much so that more people are using Google these days on their mobile device than they are on their desktop computer. Hey everyone, I'm Neil Patel and today I'm going to teach you how to decrease your mobile load time. The reason you want your website to load fast, especially your mobile website, is because the slower it loads, the more money you're going to lose. Amazon did a study and they found out that for every second their site loads slower, they lose 1% of their income. That's billions of dollars from. Sure, you're not Amazon size, but still, why would you want to lose a few percent of your income? I'd rather keep it. And the way you keep it is by increasing, or more so decreasing, your load time. The first thing you want to do is use Google AMP Framework. What the Google AMP or AMP Framework does is it ensures that your website loads extremely fast on mobile devices. If you have a WordPress blog, there's a lot of plugins that make your website AMP compatible. If you don't have a WordPress blog, you're going to have to do some custom coding, but Google walks you through how to do this. The next thing you want to do is use Google PageSpeed. When you put in your URL in Google PageSpeed, it'll show you for your mobile device what you're doing right, what you're doing wrong, and what you need to change, right? It shows you specifically for people who are using mobile phones, and it'll break down the mobile version and desktop version. But in this case, pay attention to the mobile version. Last but not least, remove any unnecessary elements. I see a lot of mobile websites that replicate their main website. Why would you want to replicate the mobile experience to the desktop experience? No one's going to go through all of the things you have on your web pages, especially if they're really long. It takes forever if you want to keep scrolling and scrolling, right? It's just not going to happen. So minimize the elements, the text, the information that you put on the mobile screen and make it more short and to the point. People will appreciate it and if you do all of these things, your mobile load time will decrease, you'll get more people on your site and more sales.